What's up guys, Multi Monkey here. Today I am bringing you uh, a complaint video, a rather angry video by me. And this is purely uh, because of something that's in FIFA 12 that we were promised wouldn't be in FIFA 12, and I'll get to that in a second. But you can tell from the title uh, that this isn't going to be a great video, as it's called EA's Promise. Uh, now that's a little bit sarcastic, because uh, in relation to this video, EA promised us that they would ban everybody that hacks their pros on FIFA 12 because on FIFA 11 there was a massive amount of hack pros. Every other pro clubs game you went into there was a hack pro whether he was just hacked to 100% accomplishment or he was hacked to 127 overall. Now FIFA 12 EA Sports said um, that they would fix this 100% everybody would be banned so people didn't hack their pros. Um, now I'm not going to name any names but I know two people on my friends list that have hacked their pros. One of them just doing the 100% accomplishments hack and the other one doing the 127. They haven't been banned. And then from the gameplay in the background you can see that we've come up against a club here with five uh, 127 overall players all at 9 foot 9 uh, over, uh, in height and their overalls are 127. This <laughs> is not really acceptable. EA made a promise to us uh, that they would make the game fixed they bring out updates every week on Ultimate Team, at least every week for the Team of the Week. Uh, they change players' overalls uh, in the summer and in January. They release transfer cards. Yet Pro Clubs hasn't been seen to whatsoever. Virtual Pros have not been fixed. I do not know one person that has been banned because of their Virtual Pro. Whether it's banned from Xbox or just banned from the A servers, it has not happened. And EA did say they would do this. I haven't got any evidence of it, but I know. And I'm sure a lot of you can remember when they uh, said this and... It hasn't happened. So in the background, like I said, we came up against a club with five 127 overalls. Now, I played clubs for around an hour and a half uh, in this little session that I was playing. And uh, I'll just use this as an example. Played ten games. Um, at least six of them had a 127 overall pro. That's not the 100% accomplishment pro uh, because that's not really detectable because they could have done it legit. Uh, it's not really detectable to us. Obviously it's to EA because there is uh, a, like a duplicate save data between people but the 127 overall is is uh, it's everywhere and it is extremely annoying because there is literally nothing you can do about these people playing yet and it is ruining the game. It is like going into Modern Warfare 2 and just constantly coming into the hacked lobbies with the unlimited grenade launchers and whatever, unlimited ammo. After the first time of seeing it, it was great. But after that, the game was ruined. And it may have been patched now, but EA have not patched it. EA have not done anything about it. And if EA make any more promises for FIFA 13, I'm not going to rely on them whatsoever. Because they made a promise for FIFA 12 to fix this and they haven't so I, I I'm sorry to kind of bring this video because I, I didn't want it to be like this I didn't want FIFA 12 to be like this because we had the promise and everybody was like yay Pro Clubs is going to be better this year but it's not at the start people were a little bit scared of doing it uh, because they, they did scaremonger by saying that and people were reluctant to do their pros but one person did it didn't get banned the second person did it didn't get banned so that spread around nobody got banned and it just as it's gone up to the point where it is the same now as FIFA 11 pretty much and <laughs> I'm really annoyed because it ruins the gaming experience they tried to get FIFA to the perfect game and it just purely it, it pisses me off the most that EA makes so many updates to Ultimate Team and nothing else ever gets seen to fair enough they do the odd fix to head to head where they downgrade a player or upgrade a player but they do that to Ultimate Team and it's just simply I imagine just coding it into it head to head but pro clubs never get seen to I'm sorry I had to do this video and I'm sorry if I did it in such a, like an angry manner um, but as always likes are appreciated if you want to tweet this to EA go ahead and do it I do not mind and uh, if you want to go ahead and spread this around I again do not mind uh, whatsoever thank you for watching as always and I'll see you guys later